I can start from Chandrayaan 3, the landing time, the most glorious historic moment. So I was uh, almost in the front row. I was monitoring our Doppler. So I come from the flight dynamics team, which is concerned with the trajectory design and maneuver design. So at the time of landing, we were, I was monitoring in the system. And that's, yes, we landed. And then we had our chairman announcing it. And then came that uh, ISTRAC had a virtual interaction with the Honorable Prime Minister. So it was a, a moment of joy, you know, some kind of a special joy, I can say, and that I could relate with the PM. He also experienced the same, and he told it's something which is very rare. And then came, he congratulated the entire uh, scientific community, ISRO community, and then he applauded our efforts. Three days later, he came to Bangalore and he met us. So I was one among the women scientists who were identified to interact with the PM. And how he started was our landing, you know, Vikram setting its foot on the moon, the South Polar region. We happened to be the first country to be in the South Polar region. He related that with Angad setting his foot. That is a firm, it's a firm. He mentioned that. And then he started like with uh, congratulating each of us and then our efforts, the scientific community and ISRO as a whole, how we uh, contribute to the uh, it, he was just telling the space sector is not just uh, launch and then the satellite missions. It is about we have to think forward what is how we can expand, especially the space sector into easing the governance and what can come to the common man. So about that he started and then he asked us to think about that. Naming our uh, Vikram landing point as Shiv Shakti, as we all know, Shiv giving us a resolution on uh, well-being of the mankind and Shakti giving us that energy. And then he re what happened is I, I happened to be in Chandrayaan 2 team also. So whenever our orbiter was imaging the upcoming Chandrayaan 3 landing site, I used to have this lat long. I used to say 69.3 and 32 degree, the prime site and all that. That is how it was happening. And then he gave a recognition to that point. You know, it was like, I can say, uh, hum log jaise bolte hai, parent has given the child to the moon. And then uh, a sage has, uh, jaise naamkaran hota hai, us place ka naamkaran unhone kiya. And it was so apt that all of us know it could, uh, it relates from Kanyakumari to greater Himalayas. And then he brought in like, uh, he wanted to emphasize the uh, women power, you know, the contribution of the women into the scientific and the space community. He told, uh, uh, I can uh, quote what he had told, Shrishti uh, Sthiti Vinashana, Shakti Bhute Sanatani, means right from creation to destruction the, in, of this universe from the beginning, there is women power behind. So that is like, he shows that respect to the mother, sisters and daughters of the nation and his encouragement. And that also, I happen to be in the tableau of the Republic Day. So there uh, he had, uh, from the PMO office, we had an invitation to witness the Republic Day. And it's the first time that ISRO had a tableau. And uh, they had nominated few women scientists who worked in Chandrayaan 2, 3 to be there on this tableau. And I was I'm happy to say that I was one among them. So it was a proud moment for me. And it shows the uh, recognition. He, he wants to highlight the contribution of the women in this particular field, the space field. His encouragement, especially for the younger generation, especially schools and colleges, he urged us, like especially the ISRO scientists, to inspire them, to guide them, share our experience. And after this, it has been a lot of programs are being conducted from our office, our HRD office conducts. And I'm happy, like I was also one of them to uh, have some speech in the schools, you know, to inspire the young minds. And whenever they visit our uh, uh, ISTRAC facility, so I happen to deliver a few lectures and explain them about Chandrayaan 3 and the next, the Aditya mission. So these all, it gives a sense of uh, pleasure and some uh, satisfaction. Like, yeah, I'm doing something for the society.